Ten years ago, we met by chance in a McDonald's car park at 3 a.m. Midway through our first conversation, you asked me what my last name was. I playfully said, it's a secret because I've got a girl's last name. Little do we know that my last name was going to become yours too. Dylan and Bree, welcome to your wedding day. Here we are, nearly 10 years in the making. You guys have achieved so much in the last decade. I'm just gonna call it a decade because we're nearly there. What you've achieved, how you feel in each other's presence, how you have become so inspirational for each other, how you've grown so much and created this beautiful relationship based on trust, friendship, having a good time, supporting each other, loving each other unconditionally. The next chapter in their lives was marriage. It's an easy one for them. What's most remarkable and important for Dylan and Bree is that they get to call their best friend, their husband and their wife. me from your goodness, you shine Now, I've watched this lo love blossom over the nine years, and I've never seen two people so truly, truly in love with each other. And I could say that, like, it's, it's the kind of love everyone wants that you see in the movies. You have made me believe in true love, and I'm sure that everyone you come across, you would make them know love is real. You shine through. Dylan. <laughs> I should probably start paying you for our conversations at this point because they're basically therapy sessions. Um, you're only 29 but still manage to have life advice in abundance. You're like the perfect mix between a wise old man and an excited little kid. I genuinely aspire to be more like you every day and I'm so unbelievably grateful to have you as a big brother and a role model in my life. I, Brie Rihanna Lenahan, happily take you, Dylan Gray Madison, as my lawfully wedded husband. Somehow, of all the people in the world and places we could be in this lifetime, my path crossed yours. Little did we know those nine years ago when we bumped into each other as complete strangers in a McDonald's parking lot, that the start of our life together was set into motion. And since then, we've worked as a team to build the life we've always dreamed of. Today, we have our forever home, fulfilling careers, dream car, an incredible support system around us, and 13 spoilt chickens. But the truth is, I've had everything I've ever dreamed of and needed from the moment I met you. But there's one thing that stands out above all else. It's what I'm most proud of. And that's the relationship that we've built together. We've had the privilege to experience one of the rarest things I believe a human can. This immense depth of love, vulnerability, and connection. In my eyes, there's no beauty in this world like yours. You're it. My Breezy. I can't already tell, I'm pretty obsessed with you. <laughs> Without even thinking, your instincts are to help others in any way possible. You're selfless, inspiring, and the most supportive friend. You're it. You are everything that truly matters. If I have you and only you in my life, then I have the most beautiful life. Everyone here today knows that to have a Dylan in their lives is to have their biggest cheerleader. To have you is to really have you. Your full attention, your patient ear, infectious joy, your effort, selflessness, the way you make others feel seen, heard and understood. To have a Dylan in your life is to be on the receiving end of the kindest love. You'll never question how loved you are because he shows you so clearly and consistently that you will always feel it. To have a Dylan is to embrace your inner child, be silly, dance, break into song, and act like two carefree kids. Yet at the same time, it's also having someone wise beyond their years, someone you can depend on, someone fiercely loyal, 
someone to create spreadsheets about everything there is to have a spreadsheet on. <laughs> Dylan and Bree, please look at each other, stare into each other's heart and soul. Family and friends, with you all as my witness, my absolute pleasure to finally and officially pronounce you both as husband and wife. Dylan, please kiss your wife for the very first time. Sixty years ago, my grandparents packed up their lives in Italy and got on a ship in hopes of a better life in Australia. As a result of that, Bree and I were lucky enough to be born in the same wonderful country. Just two years apart. We were raised by loving parents who probably met each other in a similar serendipitous way. The events that had to unfold for us to be here tonight is astounding to us. Who we are today is not only made up of our own innate equalities and intuitions, but also thanks to the circles that we've been lucky enough to grow up within. And the centerpiece of those communities for us was all of you. Each of you are here because you belong here. Our day wouldn't be complete without you. Thank you so much for joining us. You have a strong bond with mutual respect and endearing admiration that will carry through your ups and downs in marriage. You are both kind, caring and loving and those ingredients make for a wonderful relationship. You both think big and are inventive so that will make your time stimulating and ever changing. Your love of travel and adventure will add spice and excitement. Your eventual growing family will provide an abundance of love all round. Filling river beds with tears turned dry.